albums. Now, if you come over here, we have folders, and we've loaded two, three and four music was given to us. And we also have something called mobile albums and local albums. Now, this is new, mobile. We're not going to cover that in this chapter. We're going to wait a little bit on that, but I want to tell you what it is. They work and set up the same as a local, what we're going to do. But basically, everybody that you allow has access to them, say on their smartphones or whatever they have. So it's a way of kind of getting out there to the world. And anything you have in Organizer can be put into them. So what is an album? Let's talk about the locals. A local album is a way for you to reorganize some of your stuff in a way that makes it, well, valuable for whatever you're doing. You've got a couple of hundred folders, and that's obviously not unusual, and they've got all kinds of stuff in them. What you need for a particular project that you're working on is in eight or nine of those folders, but you don't want to move that stuff because you can. I mean, we can drag things from here and move them into other folders. You want temporary access to them albums okay so let's start out by going up here to this little button right here not this one click here now we have new album and we have new album categories I like to make categories because it further organizes things so if I say new album category let's call this one travel just like that now there are no categories yet so it's top level click OK and you can see right here that is not an album that's a category now select it Click the plus sign now, and you'll see new album over here. Give that a name of, say, UK, as in United Kingdom. And we do want it in the category called Travel, obviously. Click OK down here. You can see we now have Travel UK. Click the plus sign again, and we'll call this one Africa. Again, I do want it in Travel. Incidentally, you can begin dragging things over here right now if you want to. That's one way to do it. Go ahead and click OK. Let's do one more. And we'll call this one U.S. as in United States. And again, I do want it in that category. If you have more than one, you can choose whichever one you want. Selecting it over here saves you that option. It already knows what you want. Click OK. OK, so we have Africa, U.K., and U.S. over here. How do we get things into them now that we closed it out over here? It's actually pretty easy. If we come into, say, O3, now, I'm going to pretend that those elephants are shot in Africa. So I'm going to drag from here to Africa, wait for the plus sign to let go. Now, you see that little symbol right there come up for a second goes away, meaning you were successful. Now, we all know that Stonehenge in the UK, so I can come over here and drag it over. And let's move to a different folder. And let's pick up, oh, let's do two. This one and shift click on this one. And I do know those were taken, obviously, in the U.S., and drag both of those into the US. So we now have a local album. The images are still in the original albums. These are links to get to them. There's Africa, UK, and US. Now another way to make an album, let me show you something. Say we come down here to this one, 04, because it's got a lot of stuff in it. And I want to make an album out of the whole thing. Well, just right click your mouse right here on 04 and come down to Create Instant Album, and you get it up here. You say, well, what's the difference? Well, one of the differences is, of course, we can begin adding other stuff to it. But in the next lesson, we're going to do a slideshow. And so you might want these in a different order, and you can see they are named. Now, let's say we're done with our temporary album. We don't really need these anymore. So if I right-click my mouse on 04 and say Delete, it's going to say, are you sure you want to do that? But the original media will not be deleted. And we say, sure, don't want that. Same thing here. Now, you could do individual ones if you want it. But we do this, it gets them all. And again, it's not going to do anything except get rid of the album. Albums give you more organization. And as you work more and more with Elements Organizer, you're going to have more stuff. And it gives you a very nice temporary way to work with individual things across multiple folders. That's what they're there for.